Good afternoon! Been Tim back in the business. Back again with another video. Why are you raising the volume? Uh, it's been a long time since I made a new video. <clears throat> since uh, that Tahoe trip was uh, a month ago. It's been a month? Three weeks? A month? Three weeks? Three weeks? A month? That I actually uh, made a video. Ow! Went through a pothole. Today will be a pretty productive day. Right now, at the moment, we're heading to Ikea, our bed frame supporter. Uh, supp uh, what's it called? A little wooden platform. It's not a platform. It's a platform. Bed frame. Well, part of the, the underneath of the bed frame, we got the support underneath the beams, whatever pieces of wood broke. Due to my daughter's jumping on our bed. Now we're just heading over there, see what we can find, see if we can buy something. We need it, or else we're just gonna fall down and uh, we're gonna be sleeping on the floor from now on. Then uh, after we gotta head to Costco and get some groceries for the house, you guys will see something else. I've been mentioning this for a long, long time, and it finally came to it. So you guys will see this later on. See so if you want to make this a banger video, give this video a thumbs up because either way, you're gonna have to give it a thumbs up after or before the movie. Uh, movie. 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 Okay. But it's gonna be banging. Guys gonna love it. I'm gonna love it. Later on, uh, the aftermath of what's ever gonna happen. It's gonna face the consequences. Okay. Okay. We're in a Kia song. Keep walking, I'm Come on, savage. grab my hand. Ow! Hey, grab mommy's hand. Oh We're done. And. <laughs> we spent a big amount of money, large amount of money on this. We got a few stuff. So now we're waiting on the in-laws uh, to bring. Wait on the in-laws to bring a van so we can put all the stuff in because we have no space to put this in my car. So we literally spent four hours in IKEA. Why? Because as we waited for my in-laws to get here. You know, bring their van so we can put our stuff in our bed frame and stuff. Uh, they decided, or my mother-in-law decided, to uh, do some shopping herself. So we spent a total of four hours in Maybe IKEA. Who does that? Okay. So now we're finally heading home, and we are hungry. Our plans for Costco has been denied because. It is getting way too late, and they close in two hours, and uh, we don't want to go in a rush, so we'll probably head out to uh, Costco tomorrow. But I really do want to do something else, like eat. We got a lot of building to do. And uh, I will <sighs> stay up all night building our little furniture, because I also got a chair for the room, because... Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna leave it at that. <laughs> so, all right, guys. So now that we're back home now, we uh, actually had to order some pizza. But I'm gonna start doing uh, building our our beds, our bed frame. Then I'm gonna start uh, installing more of the things. So I will. Do this and uh, 
probably do this, try and do this in a quickness. So, let's start the time lapse now. So, this took me a long, long time. I was sweating here. I even had to get my wife to uh, go give me something to drink. I was really just sweating bullets. Now we're just, you know, got this down. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> Don't start. Excuse me. Now we're putting the sheets on. So. And I'm helping. <laughs> all right. So far, it looks like it's pretty nice, so. Let's uh, also have to do a stool and my chair. So Mommy, while they're doing that, I'll do that. Let's Mommy, do a time lapse on both at the too. same time, starting now. It's coming along. We got the beds all almost done. Then uh, I'm, since I made that little stool there, now she's using that little nightstand. My chair's done. I am not going to show you guys, but uh, there's a lot more stuff I need to show you guys. So. Keep watching this video, do not go bye bye and go in an intermission and go get some food like your Hot Pockets or some Cheetos or something. Hi. So. Hello. <laughs> so, keep watching the video guys. If you like it so far, keep hitting that thumbs up for all you people that haven't done it yet. So, keep watching. Good afternoon, or good noon, it's actually 12, 18 right now, and uh, I did not close out the day yesterday. So we're gonna continue with the, uh, with the videos. At the moment, we are going to Bath and Body Works. We need some canals for the roomy. So, we need some new scents, because uh, the ones we have are Jack, Period. Okay, don't mind the shaking on this video. Uh, this sucks. But, um, go to Bad Bath and Body Works, Bad Bath and, Body, Bad Bath and Beyond, BadWorks.com, what? But, uh, and then uh, I don't know where we're going after. But I still gotta show you guys something. Like I mentioned yesterday, it is the whole ideal of this video. It is the main reason I am making it. So. Huh? I like the smell of lemon. And lemon I, don't really don't, I don't really don't like the smell of lemon. Oh, and mint. Yeah. That smells so good. Strawberry mimosa. Girls, come here. Girls. Yeah. Hard to choose out here. We got so many choices. So far, we got the eucalyptus mint. Can you see that? Eucalyptus mint. That's okay. I'm kind of picky when it comes to sex. Look at this marble. So, what's up? We are at Target now. We got what? Four stupid candles for the room. Stupid? Yeah, they're stupid. They're just, you love candles. Yeah, I love candles, but they're stupid because it makes your room smell all fruity, cupcakey. I didn't even get any. 
Now we're at Target and uh, she's getting something for the bed. Hello. I'm made out of money, people. Hello. Okay. I am down here. One. 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 Where's, uh, where's it going to fit in the car? Oh, oh, goodness gracious. That's what you get. That's what happens. This is too much Star Wars, Mammy. Yeah, this is too much Star Wars. Too much what? Too much Star Wars. Star Wars? Too much dollars. Too much dollars? And you getting something else? No. <laughs> I'm dead. It's that time. The moment you guys all have been waiting for. Yeah, what in the world am I gonna, what am I doing? So, you guys seen my uh, the habanero, and I'll leak, uh, leave the link up here. But um, it's time for the ghost pepper, and I've been waiting for this moment for a long, long time. And this is not my only one, or I'm not, this is not, how do I say it? My final one, I am will be having more. And, uh, I will go right straight, straight through it as there are school heat units in case you don't know. Um, you got your habanero, yeah. your, not your habanero, your jalapeno which has 3,000 school heat units which is I think most people could tolerate that type of heat. Then you got the habanero on the, uh, what I did it was at um, 100,000, I want to say it was at 100,000 school heat units. Then goes the uh, the ghost pepper. That's 10 times worse than the habanero, which is at a million scoba heat units. After that is the Carolina, Carolina, the Carolina Reaper, which is at 9 million scoba heat units, which is currently today the world's hottest chili pepper. So, uh, right now, I do have a quart of milk because I will have to use it, maybe. And I do have the ghost peppers. Now, for so long, I've been trying to look for the fresh ones, which are supposed to be the even spicier than these. But even so, ghost pepper is a ghost pepper. There are... As it says here, right in front, it says, In 2007, Guinness Book of World Records confirmed the ghost chili as the hottest chili pepper in the world. Read that. But, it got beat by the Carolina Reaper. So, as you can see here, uh, the, that's actually a hotness comparison of what I just said about the, uh, the Scoville heat units. You got the habanero at 100,000, jalapenos at 5,000, and the ghost chili is at a million. If you guys see there, can you guys see it? Zoom, no, no. Well, it goes from jalapeno, habanero to ghost chili. Now. Now we're taking a video. Let's. Let's do this. I wanna take a video. Okay. Hi guys, how are you? I will look for the biggest one. I, I'm not trying that. No. no, I'm not trying that. Okay, you try it. Uh, yeah, that's what I'm about to do right now. I'm just looking for a big one. I do want the big one. And these are very chile. Very chile. These are the dried ones. 
So, and that's the thing with chili peppers. Don't the try outside it. skin. Yes, don't try this at home. You got that right. You know what? She's right. Do not try this at home. If you can't tolerate heat, do not do this because there will be consequences. So, as I was saying, oh, your mouth hot. the chili peppers that have the chili. they have that heat on the outer skin, they have the heat inside of the pepper, and the seeds itself carry the heat. Um, I'm gonna put this down for a minute. Let me open up the milk, just in case. You get in case you get thirsty. No, not thirsty. But okay, you guys, <laughs> you guys saw my reaction when I did the habanero, right? That was not beautiful. Now I'm gonna try this one. Oh. It doesn't look as big, but, but you have to try it. in comparison. But kids, don't try it because it's very hot. Let's do this. Do it, do it, do it, do it. <coughs> drink, drink the milk. Is it good? Drink the milk. Is it good, Daddy? Is it good? No. Drink the milk. Okay, since I bit it on this side of the mouth, that's where it's getting all. Here comes the hic... here comes the hiccups. Now you do it. <coughs> So it's getting stuck in the back of my throat right now. But I could feel the heat, the heat on this side of the mouth. I don't think I need to take milk this time. I'm getting a whole bunch of hiccups at the moment. This is not as hot as I don't know. Okay, tongue twisted here. Not as hot as I thought it would be. Like the habanero, the habanero actually got me all tingly and stuff, but uh, not these. I feel everything right now on my tongue and uh, all over my mouth. This ain't so bad. I think I'll, uh, <laughs> I'm able to handle a uh, Carolina Reaper. No, I'm not. No, actually, you know what? I'll take some milk because I'm going back out and I don't want to, you know, have some bad stomach aches. Yeah, they drink some milk. It's dripping off! Daddy! What? It's dripping off your face. Okay. It's not that bad, guys. Not that bad. I still feel the heat. I think it's picking up now. <sighs> yeah, that's not helping. Usually milk's supposed to help. It's not helping. You're supposed to have healthy food. Oh my goodness. You're supposed to have healthy, healthy food. And you're, you're supposed to eat chips. <sighs> Are you going to die? Ah, it's picking up. Oh my goodness. I know with the habaneros it got me all sweaty. 
You guys saw how sweaty it was, but. This one is not doing its job. I wanna say maybe because it's dry. It's dry pepper. Not yeah, the fresh dry, one. Dry pepper. But uh, feel it on the tip, tip of my tongue, on the roof of my mouth, on the, my left side of the tongue. It's not a good experience at the moment. But uh, I think the habanero was even more spicier than this one. I think that's it. So, if you guys like this, then uh, give that thumbs up, you know? Give that thumbs up if you want to see more chili pepper videos, more challenges, or just have spiciness. I want to watch too. Then uh, keep giving that thumbs up, give me more requests. And I'll keep doing it. But um, I've also seen some other videos of this, uh, like this uh, Paki. There's this other spread called Paki. is a uh, Carolina Reaper chip. This is this one chip challenge where it's like a Dorito chip. And uh, it's covered with Carolina Reaper pepper. Uh, the Carolina, Carolina Reaper, yeah, pepper, uh, like dust. Man, so one. It's 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 by one chip. It comes in a box, and uh, I'm gonna have to try that over those and try that out. But I'll see if I can get more people to try this with me. I have a whole bag of it, so maybe we'll have my wife try it with me one day. Uh, Thanks for watching, guys. Big Tank, out!